limited warranty with the Jets and Maserati. Monday, August 27th, 2 p.m. Minnesota State Fair Grandstand, 612-642-2262. And, and take my advice, I listened to the album last night. I, I, I bet you guys are great live. What's the difference between yourself on record and live? Quickly. Better, better live, better live. Oh, yeah. Thanks for being with us today. Do me a favor, when you win all the Grammys and, and you go on to huge fame and fortune, come back and uh, be with us, will you? You can go. Thank you. Everybody, that we are going to be out at the State Fair tomorrow, Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday of next week. And uh, we're going to uh, tell you about some of those shows. We're going to have teen models and their moms tomorrow. Monday, we're going to have Ellie Mae Clampett, Eddie Haskell, and Eddie Munster, if you can believe that. Tuesday, we're going to have What Makes Triplets Tick. And Wednesday, is Satan in Your Child's Toy Box. That should be interesting, to say the least. So I want to thank you guys for being with us. And I want to go to the audience and get some more questions in here as fast as possible. And a good one right here. Um, is it hard because people know you in limited warranty to form relationships because they don't know you as yourself? Excuse me? What, what type Sorry. of relationship? Is it hard for you to get into a relationship with someone because they know you as limited warranty instead of as yourself? I think we've all established relationships before, you know, things really got going. So, so uh, yeah. I mean, it's not like we're all cruising the singles bars or anything. Yeah. But I don't, I, we don't, we're not very paranoid of that. Uh, People are people, and I think if people get to know us, they'll find out we're just people, too. You say you aren't married, but do you want to be married? Uh, yeah, someday. It's at some point. 30, maybe. Is that a proposal, or is that... Do you guys all have girlfriends? Yeah, yeah I think we all do. Yeah. <laughs> yes, we are. looking at me for? Probably. <laughs> yeah. Um, are you going to finish your college education? Well, Eric's finished. Eric's Some finished. of us are halfway through. I think I plan it to go depends, back. Depends, right yeah. Yeah, I would. I want to finish my. So if I can I've keep, made a promise yeah. to myself. If I can keep the career going in one form or another, I don't know that we need to. Some of us. If the band doesn't work out in a few years, what you guys plan to do with your career? We're gonna be surfers in. Uh, yeah. Washington. <laughs> <laughs> when we when we're, out, we're out at Star Search, uh, we spent a lot of time in Venice Beach and we decided that if the band wasn't going to go, that was the buy place a for us. Boat. There's a guy roller skating with guitar. Right, sell there. the truck and buy a boat. What's the most memorable show you've ever played? What was what? The what? most memorable show you've ever played. It's been a lot. That's really hard to answer that. Jamesville, Wisconsin. Each show is unique in its own way. There's been a couple of bigger shows, but uh, that's, uh, that's impossible to answer. State Fair last year was great. Yeah, State Fair was great. So you like performing at the State Fair. Go ahead. How do you feel about the certain about the censorship on certain albums? Oh, that's hmm. a that's, that's a really long, it's a pretty long diverse question. issue. I don't know. I don't think it should be censored. <laughs> yeah, it's hard yeah. to do that in thirty seconds. Yeah. <laughs> when did you guys all start playing your instruments? I mean, from what individually it was? Junior high? Is that right? Yeah. yeah. Mom high started school, me on the piano when I was about five. We all played yeah. the Beatles We're all 65 in the band. record. Yeah. Let's give them a big thank you for being with us. Limited warranty. Thank you for being with us here at the State Fair. Be sure to come out with us. Thanks for being with us at home. Take care of yourself today. And provided by the Radisson University Hotel. 615 Washington Avenue Southeast on the University of Minnesota East Bank Campus. Limousine service for the guest of Twin Cities Law provided by Henderson Chauffeur Cadillacs. Hair and makeup courtesy of the Hair Forum, Westbrook Mall, Brooklyn Center.